Hello and welcome to C++ 11 Beginner Tutorials by Gamer to Creator. I'm Chris. Real quick, I wanted to introduce one more data type. It is the last one uh, of the built-in data types, and you will be using this one quite often. And it's different from the rest, because the rest are really just numbers. Even the character is really just a number. And I guess that you could say that this is also a number, but it's really only two values. One or zero. One is true, and zero is false. This is called a bool or a boolean value. And I'm going to call it, I'm going to declare a bool, and I'm going to call it b. And it is usually one byte, because that's the smallest amount of memory that you can allocate. Uh, but it technically, <coughs> excuse me, only needs one bit to be a one or a zero. It can be true or false, which is really just a one or a zero to a computer. And this is used in logic, where you can say, if something is true, then do something, and if something is false, then do something else. This is how you control a program's execution. We'll get into this a little bit later, but it's important that you understand that this data type is available to you, and that it is always either true or false, and it can never be anything else.